and we will discuss how you may use conditional statements to effectively make these aspects adaptive. In this video, we will learn what aspects of your prototype are adaptable by making edits between the view tabs and which are not. And we will discuss how you may use conditional statements to effectively make these aspects adaptive. The next important aspect to pick up on before we can move on with a more practical demonstration is what can be changed by editing adaptive views. Now to generalize, contents of widgets cannot be changed between views and interactions cannot be changed between views. These two points need expanding upon because it's not as clear cut as it sounds. The first um, whilst you can change how widgets appear where they are located sized and styled ie the formatting you cannot change the content let's illustrate this by editing the paragraph that we created earlier let's go to the medium view and change the font size and the width of the paragraph we don't expect these formatting changes to affect the base view We'll make some changes to the text in our paragraph to illustrate how content is fixed across views. If we go to our base view, we'll find that the formatting of our paragraph remains as is. However, the text change that we made has been applied. So formatting is adaptive via adaptive views but content is not. This, the exceptions to this rule are twofold. You can use unplace from view, the opposite of place in view, to simply displace a widget and replace it with an entirely new one. But this, this is not always a good idea. More on this later. You can also use page load interactions or other events to affect changes to content based on which adaptive view is currently showing. Which brings us nicely to our next point. Interactions are not adaptable. This one needs to be taken with a pinch of salt because whilst you can't create different interactions for each adaptive view by using the view tabs in the same way we've been making formatting changes, you can create interactions that query the adaptive view. We will pick this up later. Uh, we'll use this technique in coming videos. So to recap, widget formatting and placement is adaptable, but content and interactions are not adaptable by navigating the view tabs and simply making edits. We can use conditional statements to effectively adapt content and interaction, however. 